I'm David Toman, author of NootropicsExpert.com, and in this video I'm going to share with you what I know about glycine as a nootropic, what it is, why we use it, the science behind it, dosage, and side effects. Glycine is one of the most important amino acids in your body. It helps in the regulation of cardiovascular, cognitive, and metabolic health. The name glycine comes from the Greek word for sweet tasting. Glycine was discovered in 1829 by French chemist Henri Braconneau after boiling gelatin with sulfuric acid. And since then, it's been manufactured and distributed commercially as a sweetener and as a buffering agent for antacids. Glycine is a sweet and colorless crystal that is synthesized in your body from choline, threonine, and serine. As a therapeutic and nootropic supplement, it provides multiple benefits to human health. Glycine has been shown to be effective in improving skin elasticity, and collagen peptide, which is loaded with glycine, helps suppress sun-induced sun, sun damage and reduce wrinkles around the eyes. Glycine supplementation helps reduce the symptoms of schizophrenia. It helps reduce the symptoms of OCD, and low blood levels of glycine has been associated with depression. Numerous studies have also shown that glycine's potential in improving sleep, enhancing memory, and increasing insulin sensitivity. Glycine modulates the inhibitory neurotransmitter via glycine receptors throughout the central nervous system, and it potentiates NMDA receptors, which provides an excitatory response, affecting cognition, memory, immune function, and sleep. Glycine boosts brain health and function in several ways, but two in particular stand out. Now first, for sleep. There's been numerous studies that show that glycine influences the quality of sleep, it reduces insomnia, and it promotes restful sleep. It does this in a couple of ways. Glycine is a particular affinity for NMDA receptors and glycine receptors, which results in increased peripheral blood flow and a subsequent drop in core body temperature. In other words, glycine works to improve blood flow to the body's extremities, which in turn reduces core body temperature. This decrease in body temperature plays an important part in sleep induction, since the onset of sleep is associated with lowered body temperature, which then progresses to deep sleep. Research has demonstrated this in an animal study showing how glycine triggered a drop in body temperature, which helped the study subjects fall asleep more quickly and spend more time in REM sleep. The study also showed that glycine can help your experience, you experience deep sleep and slow wave sleep more quickly. Glycine has been shown to increase the production of serotonin in your brain, which helps sleep because serotonin aids in the synthesis of the sleep hormone melatonin. Studies also suggest that glycine can help you get back to your regular sleep cycles after a disrupted sleep schedule. And second, for schizophrenia. Glycine has been shown promising results in reducing the symptoms of depression, OCD, anxiety, and bipolar disorder. However, its most pronounced efficient efficacy is seen in the reduction of schizophrenia symptoms. Postmortem evaluations of the brains of people with schizophrenia have shown fewer NMDA receptors compared to those who did not have the disease. Researchers also found decreased levels of glycine in both the blood and the cerebral spinal fluid of people with schizophrenia. Glycine is known to be an NMDA agonist. It is well tolerated by patients with both short and long-term treatment. To date, numerous studies have been conducted to evaluate the efficacy of glycine in treating schizophrenia. The first controlled trial used a glycine dose of 15 grams a day, which showed significant improvement during glycine treatment. Another study with 21 schizophrenia patients were given high doses of glycine in addition to antipsychotic treatments. A significant 34% reduction in negative symptoms was observed during glycine treatment, and the study authors noted the improvement persisted even after the patient stopped supplementing with glycine. Glycine activates NMDA receptors in your brain, and it restores serotonin levels, which, help, which helps improve sleep and the ability to fall asleep faster. In one study, 15 adult females were given either a placebo or 3 grams of glycine before bed. 
the study concluded that supplementing with glycine showed a significant improvement in reduced fatigue, liveliness, and clear-headedness the next morning. Glycine helps brain cell signaling, which boosts cognition, memory, and mood. And glycine taken in high doses is proven to be effective in reducing the symptoms of schizophrenia. It helps with depression and, the, and mental fluency associated with schizophrenia and may improve psychotic symptoms as well. Evidence also suggests that glycine assists in depression and neurodegenerative diseases such as Alzheimer's and Huntington's. Glycine also showed in a protective effect against the neurological damage associated with stroke. And research suggests improvements in memory, recall, and sustained attention in those supplementing with glycine as a nootropic. People who take high-quality glycine supplements report a better sleep quality and improved mood the next day. Some users say that they feel more balanced and livelier once they started supplementing with glycine. Glycine is best taken 60 minutes before bed, and most users report a minimum of seven hours of undisturbed high-quality sleep. Glycine helps even chronic insomniacs fall asleep easily. Unlike most sleep inducers, glycine does not leave you feeling groggy and fatigued in the morning. On the contrary, users wake up feeling refreshed and ready to tackle the day. Glycine is a good joint health supplement because it aids in, the, in cartilage regeneration and enhancing collagen resynthesis. Glycine may also provide relief from night sweats for premenopausal and menopausal women. I've got more clinical studies and research into glycine if you want to see it. Go over to Nootropics Expert and search for my review on glycine or click on the link below this video which will take you through to the transcript for this video. I've got more studies on glycine for schizophrenia. I've got more studies on glycine for sleep and glycine for learning and memory. Again, that's in the original transcript for this video. The recommended nootropic dosage for glycine is 3 grams per day. Profe medical professionals recommend a glycine dosage of 0.4 grams per kilogram of body weight twice daily when taking it with typical antipsychotic drugs. Many human trials have safely used glycine at doses of 1 gram per day for supporting brain health after a stroke and up to 50 grams per day for schizophrenia. Most glycine supplements come in 1,000 milligram capsules, and the most effective dose is reported to be 3 grams 60 minutes before bed. Glycine supplements are generally considered non-toxic and safe with few side effects in most people. However, supplementing with 9 grams or more of glycine may result in things like mild gastrointestinal symptoms like upset stomach, nausea, loose stools, and vomiting. Slight sedation is also possible with, after taking glycine. Do not take glycine if you're on the antipsychotic clozapine because unlike other drugs used to treat schizophrenia, glycine appears to decrease the effectiveness of this drug in some people. And do not use glycine if you're suffering from diarrhea as it may worsen the condition. And due to a lack of sufficient research, glycine should be avoided by breastfeeding in pregnant women unless it's okayed by your doctor. Glycine is available in 1,000 milligram capsules, 500 milligram tablets, and as a powder. Now look for glycine supplements with zero other ingredients. Try do your best to avoid glycine supplements containing things like magnesium stearate and silicon dioxide and stearic acid and the, and the such. So my nootropics expert recommendation for glycine is up to 3 grams per day. And that's my report on glycine. If you want to see links to the studies I talked about, go to nootropicsexpert.com and search for glycine or click on the link below this video. There you'll find a full transcript of this video. And you'll find dozens of articles in all the well-known nootropics over on Nootropics Expert. And if you have any questions or you want to share your experience using glycine, please use the comment section below this video or at the bottom of my glycine review on Nootropics Expert. I try my best to respond to comments and questions as quickly as I can. If, I have, if you haven't already, 
download your free copy of Secrets of the Optimized Brain. It's nearly 100 pages and it contains details on 92 of the most popular nootropics used today. And consider getting a copy of my book Head First, The Complete Guide to Healing and Optimizing Your Brain with Nootropic Supplements. Head First is nearly 600 pages and it's the best guide on the planet for fixing and optimizing your brain. And if you could use some personal help with choosing the right nootropics or figuring out how to deal with your own brain health issues, consider booking a personal consultation with me. You'll find a link to my calendar below. And if you want to see more videos on all the best nootropics used today, subscribe to this channel before you leave. I'll be putting up new videos on nootropics and optimizing your brain every week. I'm David Toman, author of Nootropics Expert.